special today food all-star Thanksgiving all month we've been noticing we've been pairing up some of the biggest names in the food world to bring you must-have Thanksgiving recipes and today our super chefs are focusing on vegetarian side dishes today food yeah. contributor Jada De Laurentiis is making butternut squash lasagna and the Food Network's Bobby Flay will show us some great Brussels sprouts recipes. I just want to mention this is not a competition, which is good. Yes, it is. Because if it were a competition, <laughs> they would lose. Oh. Because oh. this is good. Oh, it's on, Laura. All right, let's go. <laughs> Make yes. this. You I love this. Start, go ahead. Right? Let's yeah. go. Talk so, about ingredients. Butternut squash lasagna. First of all, I use... Um, the lasagna sheets, these, have you ever used these before? You don't have to boil them. What are the chances of that, right? No, I haven't. I'm just, okay, Matt. No. Okay. Matt, go with me on this journey. Put this anyway, in. Anyway, this makes it really easy, so one less pot, okay? okay. All right. I'm gonna do cookies, give a little sweetness of Italian flavor to the butternut squash, and then the rest, pesto, store-bought, you don't have to make it. So I, I cut through a lot of the steps. The first thing you wanna do is take an acorn squash, mm -hmm. and it can be any squash you like, butternut squash, whatever you want. Um, cut it up, I steam it with a little bit of salt, okay? So then it comes out like this. You can put this in here, so we're gonna puree it. Okay, can yeah. you do it now? Yeah, yeah, All right. I a little muscle in there. There's the amaretti cookies in here. I only put three, they add a little sweetness, a little bit of almond flavor. Okay, all in there. Matt, try Got to it. keep it in there. Sorry. There you go. There we go. And then you take this. Matt, you're making me nervous, calm down. No, no, I just wanna, <laughs> okay. get to, I wanna make sure we get to we're, show we're gonna, it. We're gonna get to Bobby, don't worry. You this takes a time. minute. Jada, take your time. Yeah. And then this takes forever to, to just get right. <laughs> It's not working. Let's pretend that's worked and it ends okay. up like this. So it ends up like this with the cookies. Why don't you just take a little taste of it alone with the cookies? Because okay. I think it's quite fantastic. It's delicious. Okay, great. So then... A lot better than a raw Brussels sprout. Oh, thank you. Ooh! Okay. So wow. this is a bechamel. Flour, milk, and butter. Okay. okay. You mix it all together with a little bit of um, pesto, store-bought to make it nice and green. You layer it on the bottom. It sounds like your Brussels sprouts are burning, Bobby, just FYI. Um, <laughs> Maybe because you the, guys are taking the pesto so long. <laughs> which goes on the bottom. You take these lasagna sheets, you layer them on top. The key to this, though, is to have enough liquid, okay? Let's be fair, okay? You've done the layering. This is what it looks like. You pop it in the oven for and how you, long? And you add mozzarella and Parmesan cheese, then you top it in the oven, and well, the thing... Really wait, 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 I just want to say one thing. You add the uh, bechamel on top, then you put the panko, that you add a little olive oil to, and you put it in the oven. 350. Well done. For 25 minutes, covered, then uncovered oh for another goodness. 15. She's okay, like, like that. Can you go stretch ahead, it out go, anymore? Go, go. Can we make our Brussels sprouts now? You have like three minutes. Even even I, even I, even I, come, on come on, Bobby, what do we do? All right, so we're gonna make a Brussels sprout dish with pomegranates and pistachios. Delicious. Very quick tip, you cut the, uh, the pomegranate in half, yeah. and you just hit it with a, the back of a wooden spoon, yes. and the pomegranate seeds come out. You save okay. a lot of money and a lot of time doing that, okay? Right. Let's move on down. Okay. Pomegranate molasses, one oh, of the keys to amazing so things. Creamy. Can you so see good. this? Look how creepy this oh, is. Oh, you had your time. <laughs> oh, thank goodness for those amaretto cookies. Oh, yeah. All right. I'm jealous. So, so we're gonna make a vinaigrette with some red wine vinegar, mm -hmm. pomegranate molasses, a little bit of oil, yes. and, uh, and a little bit of honey and some parsley. You wanna mix okay, that up for sure. me? Yep. And so here's what I do. I take the Brussels sprouts and I blanch them first. So hot water, some salt, yeah. I cut them in half. I put them in the in the water just to cook them about halfway through. Mm -hmm. Put them in ice water and you shock them and they and they and they keep that nice green color. I like they're then gorgeous. I, then I put, thank you so much, Anna. You're welcome. Then I take a very hot sheet pan. So in the in the oven, warm the sheet pan and then put it cut side down so you get that nice sort of roasted yeah. uh, color on the outside. And then we're going to take our vinaigrette that you just made, mm -hmm. pour a little bit on top, mm. some of our pomegranates. Those smell fantastic. And look how beautiful. Very, look very colorful. And then I make a relish with some more pomegranates and a little bit of parsley. And I put it right on top. Oh. And, then, and, and a few little crispy uh, Brussels sprout leaves. Actually, it looks go. really pretty together. Mm. It looks Doesn't nice. Doesn't it? Well, Doesn't actually, I was going to say that Jada's dish, like if you wanted to have a vegetarian entree, that, that could actually take the place of the mm -hmm. turtle. And turkey. you can yeah. make it the day in advance and let it cool and cut it in those cubes and it could be your appetizer. This, is a, to this is a total crowd pleaser in my house, the um, the pomegranates. My, my oh, family. Oh. My goodness. <laughs> Look at this. Wow. Thanksgiving is wow. never going to be the go same. Labor let's so yeah. let's let the guys downstairs weigh oh, yeah. in on this. Okay, we have These our tasters. Really? Thank you. Brussels sprouts are good. They're, yeah. they're, they're phenomenal. Good. They're great, Bobby. They are, great. Bobby. They are. I will tell you, Jada, I stole 
Hoda. Hoda's top after I ate mine yeah. of yeah. yours. Yeah, because yeah. Hoda can't eat cheese. She can't eat cheese. This, we don't need details this, on that right this, now. Please. This thing is amazing. But back it's to delicious. the Brussels sprouts. The Brussels sprouts are good, Bobby. Listen, you didn't even Brussels taste sprouts this. are good. I know, but so you're now not, that's not fair. It's like cheese they and cheese. Each other. I mean, this they is a harder thing task. Anybody can slap some pasta and cheese together. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Because oh. 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 I've tasted yours. Oh. You know oh. And that means not everybody can. All kidding aside, this dish here makes me think about Thanksgivings from my childhood. Are you going to start crying? I'm sorry. Laying it on thick. We're back after Thanks the local out. news. I was watching. <laughs> Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.